So here we are on day three, heading up to Klein and Matterhorn, is that it? Klein Matterhorn, <laughs> in that. We got our ticks, and we're ready to roll. Why the scarf? Because it's down here, it's about 61 degrees Fahrenheit. Up there, it is supposed to be in the 40s, because it's about 6,000 feet higher. So we'll see how this goes. That's right. What are we in, Mama? We are in a, um, <laughs> what do you say, Paige? What do you say, Joe? Yay! Yes! So here we are, we're in the, Dog, the cable can I sit on that side too? No. We can all sit wherever we want. Here, let me sit in the middle. You can sit near the edge. <laughs> ah, because that way Melma doesn't have to look. This yes. goes straight. I, I can't look see. out. Alright, dudes, let's take a look. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's our hotel. <laughs> How cool is that? This is exciting. <laughs> How are you doing, Mama? Herzlich willkommen im Matterhorn Express. Genießen Sie die Fahrt. Alright, we are up in the air, rocking it. Can't really see much. We can look out this way. Here we have the view out the window on this cable car. And we're looking around. <laughs> There's the chapel that we toured yesterday. A little dinky one in the middle of, was it Blatner? That's Blatner. Blatner. Oh, Zemsky, I can't Ah, this was Blatner. Some days up the road. Yes. Gorgeous. Paige has decided it's easier to take the cable car than it is to hike up mountains. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing, Mama? Now we're in the midst of yeah, Mama, right, right here. staying here. We were just told that we are supposed to stay seated if we're on a charter's hike. So we're not getting up here. We're staying sit sit seated. Right, Joe? Yeah, seated. Right, Paige? Yeah. We don't get off here. Although it's pretty cool looking. So if we kept on going, this would actually take us to Italy. I don't know if you can see that. So yesterday we actually walked right there and then we went up that trail to Glacier Garten, which is up there. And Josie, or I mean Paige and I walked that bridge. She can barely see over there. But now we're going beyond that, up this way, in a major, major way. How do you feel about that? It's gonna be exciting. How are you doing, Mama? I'm thrilled. I'm just so thrilled. <laughs> How about you, Beiji? At least it's not a glass bottom thing. That would be too frightening. That'd be so funny. I'm having a blast. This is so much fun. <laughs> so, pretty, as Paige just noticed, though. there's snow right up there. That's the bridge JoJo and I crossed so, over the air. Down there. JoJo and Melmo crossed that bridge right there because they didn't take the hanging bridge that we took, which is right there. Which is pretty cool. And there's another view down towards Fury. And then up there, uh, what was it we went to? Gornergrat, which is way up there, like way up where the snow is. Mama and I took that last year. No, so we are doing really well. Way. We're on our way up. Let's check in. How you doing, Joe? <laughs> Good. You doing okay? Yeah. You're not freaked out about all this? <laughs> and the bumps that we just hit. How you doing, Mama? Oh, I'm great. You sure? This is our arrow lane. Okay, so we're at six, seven. I'm all right, right here. This is good. <laughs> oh, you look at the glaciers. We're at seven thousand six twenty-five feet. And here's what it looks like. There is hotel restaurant Schwarzy, and we'll be coming back to this after we go up to. Matterhorn Glacier Paradise. Yep, of course. That person's in a tank top. Whoa, a lot chillier here. Sit it down. We're almost to snow level. We're going down. There it is. The Matterhorn, a little more close and personal. Pretty sweet 
Jojo, what's happening right now? Um, we're going down. And, and what's wrong with Memo? Uh, she's afraid of heights. Are you doing all right? Oh, it's not that far oh, yeah. down. Look it's this way, Memo. Far down. I'm not looking that way. Why not? <laughs> you can't even see anything. So right now we're going because pretty much straight down. Because nobody wants puke on them this early in the morning. <laughs> Wait, where's the next train you can meet? Oh, up there. As we're climbing, we see some sheep that are very pretty. Black faces. Black feet. <laughs> black kneecaps. I don't know. Here's the view of where we're at. We just went through Ferg. Keep on climbing. There's the Matterhorn from this vantage point. Tucked away in some clouds today. See the little Monopoly house there? It's Horn and Lute, I think is how you say it. It's the last stop before you actually climb the Matterhorn. So imagine that job. He's standing up there. He's working on it. They stop. He's waving us like, everything's fine. I didn't need to fix anything. <laughs> We've made it! So we're at how many feet up? 12,739. And you doing okay? Well, my ears keep popping. How about you? I made it! <laughs> <laughs> Poor Melmo, it's never gonna do this again. <laughs> so cool, literally. And I think that's the Matterhorn over there. How are you doing up here, PG? Good. Good? A little not too All the skiers. So we are way up, like, I don't even know how many feet up, 13,000 feet for these zero foot Whoa. sea level people. <laughs> this is pretty heavy. Did you guys want to go up to the lookout piece? Sure. Okay. So we are way, way up. It was a little weird. Um, Maybe a little bit of nausea. Not for me so much. Bit. But Mama definitely. How about you? A little bit. So I have this over my ears because they're getting chilly. Should have brought a hat. It's pretty cool. The big warning to give you is not to rush. Because the air is ultra thin up here. But we're doing all right. Taking deep breaths and relaxing. Doing all right, Joe? <laughs> How you doing, PG? Pretty good? It's, um, 
for a bit. What's wrong? Had to go for a bit. That's fine. We'll just take it easy. You know, just walking through the mountain. Had like 13,000 feet. This is what it looks like. So here we are, uh, still at Matterhorn Glacier Paradise, in actual snow, which is probably the second or third time Josie's seen snow in her life. What do you have to say about it? It's pretty cold. Do you want to pick it up and show us? No, this is dirty. Oh, it's dirty snow. Oh, here comes Paigey. Hey, Paigey. What do you think about this snow? Icy. This is what, the third, fourth time you've seen snow in your life? <laughs> so much fun. And then we're gonna go to the uh, glacier something or another. I don't know what it's called. What is the thing we're gonna do? Oh, snowball fight. This is really good packing snow. Why don't you show, show it on the camera? See? Josie's making her second snowball of her life. Right? It's actually not that cold. I mean, it's cold, but it's not that cold. Yeah. <coughs> so much fun. <laughs> so gorgeous up here. We'll do a little panorama. I really suck it. And then we'll go and do our little tour of the ice glacier or something or another. We'll, we'll call it what it is when we see it. That's what you get. This is gorgeous over here. Look at this. Matterhorn's looking nice and not too tall. All right, we're in the ice caves. And this is quite the journey. It's chilly and downhill. Pretty sweet, eh? Holy moly, that's chilly. Are we ready, ladies? Yes, we're ready. All done? Take me, take me, take me, take me. <laughs> Okay. How about you? <laughs> oh, that's, yeah. that's gonna be a lot. In the hey, we can't open the window all the way. No, and no, we're rocking no. it. Jojo, how do you feel? I'm feeling good. Paigey? I wasn't as nauseous as last time, so. So far, so good? Yeah. Okay. And Mama? Hi, Mom. You're great. <laughs> she means you might toss her cookies. But over there, right over his Matterhorn, <laughs> and let's see if we can actually zoom in on uh, Hornley. I don't even know how to say it. 
one lead. It's basically the lodge closest to the Matterhorn. It's right there. I think you can see it. Yeah, I can see it through the lens. And then up behind that cloud is the little emergency. It's not even a lodge, it's just a room they built right into Matterhorn. But you can Google it and see all the details and it actually shows you inside. That's all for now. So we literally just got off here in Swartzi, and look what happened. Now my bark got Everything is not moving. Everything is brought to a halt. Like the moment we stepped off. Literally. But, it's going again. Must have fixed it. What do you say? Oh. <laughs> so we're keep we're walking through uh, Swartzi, and look. The uh, cable car, I don't know if you can see them in there. They're not moving. <laughs> that would have drawn did it. We made it. Somehow, some way, they didn't shut off until we just stepped off. Isn't that weird? <laughs> Somebody's looking out for us. On our hike down to Zmut, this is a view from probably 7,000 feet, I would imagine. You can see the Matterhorn peeking up over there. Just stopped to take in these views. I believe right down there is Zermont. That's our destination. It's about two hours out. About two and a half hours. Take a look at all these flowers. All kinds of goodies here. Let me come over here. down there and that looks like some form of mine we'll have to look that up later on the googs figure out what that thing is how do you feel about all this PG pretty cool and there is the beautiful Matterhorn on our way down to Smoot hiking from Swartzy we're at the altitude where the trees are just starting to come up be down. I don't know what it would be. Probably 6,000 feet, maybe? 7,000? I really don't know. There's Josie way down there. Pagey. You should see Mel Mel and Blue coming up. And we're heading down to Smut, which I believe is down in the valley here to the right somewhere. But I really wanted you to see this as we make our way down. How beautiful this is. So there's a lot of butterflies here in this little stream coming down from the mountain. You can see them out. There's some. Hey Pagey, how you doing? Huh. A lot of going straight down pretty much.
Boy, look at that. This is where that restaurant was, and it was supposed to be really good, but it burnt down. So they're rebuilding it. But we can't have lunch there today. Uh, it's not there right now. But look at that view of the Matterhorn. Yeah. From it. Amazing. Sit on the top of and see that. Yeah. All right, onward. Maybe I'll do that to my garden next year, Daddy. I'll only plant pink and white flowers. That sounds awesome. So we made it down what was very treacherous coming in and out of uh, switchbacks. And uh, now we're on a road. We're going down some month for lunch. And it was awesome coming through from rocks to grass to trees to streams to butterflies to flowers. I hope I captured it all for you. Hope you're having an awesome journey with us on this video. Let's take a look at what we're looking at forward here, huh, shall we? <laughs> There's PG. And we're hiking out of, what was the name of the town we were just in? Staffel Alp. Staffel Alp. And then there's that little cable car right there that goes up to whatever that is that must be a mine up there. But you can see the yellow or the orange balls all the way up there. It's interesting. I'm gonna have to Google that. And then this goes to Hiri. Siri Sussovan. Doesn't look like it's actually running right now. So what is this? This is the end of the glacier. It starts up there and it comes down. All the way up there. And here's where it's all melting. When this wow. in Jersey, I think the water will be nice and warm. Look how clear blue that is. That is gorgeous. Jojo, what do you feel? You want to go swimming in that? It's an easy hike down. <laughs> All out. right. <laughs> Onward, upward, over, downward. To Zermatt. Via Zermatt. This way. See the tail right over there. Right up the side of that mountain. To the mountain over there, I'm not sure for what. Just casually walking along. What do you see? Check this out. Oh man, is that cool? So here we are at a crossing and a cool little drive that goes through the mountain, it looks like. A crossing of sorts. Or not. We'll find out. Let's see where this cave goes. Shall we?
we had an absolutely amazing lunch in Zamut. And I'll show you some pictures right now of the meals we had. A big salad, a roasty with, what does Mel have? She had cheese and Paige had egg and some awesome European bread, which is so tasty. Now we're on our way to Zermatt. We're taking this path. It's gonna be about another hour or so. So here we are on our way down, and Paigey has a lot to say about how we should be ziplining right now on this beautiful journey down into Zermatt. So take a look at this. Paigey thinks we should zipline from over here to over there, and then over here, over there, and just keep on going down without getting too much momentum, because we learned the more momentum you get in ziplining, how do the cable is. We don't want to burn up our cables or our gloves. Pretty cool. Nice hike through the pines as we make our way down to Zermatt. It's so gorgeous. Let's take a look up. There she comes. Way down there is the river goes into Zermatt. We are nearing in on Zermatt. Josie and Mama are pointing out things. I think the hotel we stayed at was right over there. A couple years back, cable car is going right into by where our hotel is. Beautiful hike down. And we're back. And if you can see over there is our hotel. I don't know if I can get it in the picture. It's like right over there. <laughs> where, right where we started today. It's such a cool adventure. Back downtown, how do you feel, Joe? 20,000 steps today. 17 million stories. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> I can't, I can't even put it in words. <laughs> Paige, you can't even put it in words. She did great. So now it's time for this. Oh yeah. That's our treat. So we made it back in time to see the goats in Zermatt every day at 5 o'clock. And the remnants. Hello, Doc. Watch Mama and the place getting the goods. 
Oh, all kinds of goodies. Hi there, and thank you so much for watching my video. I just want to take a moment and say thanks for giving me the opportunity to show you how to live a healthy, wealthy, happy life. Many, 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 many years of struggle were part of that whole journey for me. Used to live really in my head, I would call it, where I was all about making sure I was taking care of what I gotta do, I can't possibly go on vacation. I was kind of a grump about it too. <laughs> so, got real clear on a few things over the last dozen years or so, and now I've been blessed to help so many others in the same ways as well. So with that being said, if you want more clarity, more energy, more purpose, more fun in life, I challenge you to take my 10 day health, wealth and happiness challenge. It's one topic per day, breaks down exactly what I did to get out of my head, to enjoy life more, enjoy people more, enjoy adventure more. And if you want to take that to the next level, I'd love for you to take my life assessment. This really helps you understand how to create a life, to concentrate on the right things, to really help you grow into your life's work, your life's ambitions. Make sure you're on the right path every day and really give you that freedom, clarity, let's just say less stress and less overwhelm, <laughs> along those lines too. And then finally, if you want to live into what I call the five Ps, to live with more purpose, more passion, more positivity, more productivity, not necessarily getting more done, but getting the right things done in life, like living into your life's ambitions, your life's work, and profitability, I challenge you to take my business assessment. They're all linked below. I'd love to help you out. I'd love to make sure that whatever I can do to help you on your path in life, I'm living in the fullest of me. Because my dream is for you to live healthy, wealthy, and happy. And to really go after your life's ambitions. Got a short amount of time on this planet. Want to make sure you're taking the most, making the most of it. So that being said, take care, have a good one. And I hope these videos have inspired you, helped you, motivated you, even give you maybe a little tactics to really live into your best self. Take care, have a good one, bye-bye.